Hello and welcome to Various Random and today I'm gonna show you another Karen's in the Wild or Public Freak Out. Please help me by hitting a like button, subscribe button and really leave a comment of which uh, part you like the most because it, it will help with the YouTube's algorithms to help me grow. Thanks for your kind support and let's dig into today's videos. I'm gonna play a fucking new song. Fuck this shit. Give me a fucking break. One minute left. One minute fucking left. You're gonna give me fucking one minute? There's a look at that fucking sign right there. One minute. Let me fucking tell you something. Let me tell you something. I've been around since fucking 1980 fucking eight. And you're gonna give me one fucking minute? You gotta be fucking kidding me. You fucking kidding me. What the fuck? I'm not fucking Justin Bieber, you motherfuckers. You gotta be fucking joking. This is a fucking joke. I got one minute, one minute left. Oh, now I got nothing left. Now I got nothing left. Let me show you what one fucking minute fucking me. One minute. God fucking love you all. We'll be back. This video is going viral after a woman freaks out on an airplane claiming that everyone on board was going to die after she saw a weird figure in black head to the back of the plane. Take a look. Say whatever you want. I'm telling you, I'm getting the f off, and there's a reason why I'm getting the f off, and everyone can either believe it or they cannot believe it. I don't give two f but I am telling you right now, that mother f that mother back there is not real. And you can spit on this plane and you can die with them or not. I'm not going to. What's even scarier is that this comes just a couple of days after a British man on a flight from Croatia saw the same man and tried to open up the plane doors to escape him. What's going on? It's okay. <laughs> I know. I got it. Can you guys shut the blinds down? Just shut the blinds down. Just shut everything down. Shut it. Just shut the other one for me too and then just lock up. Get this one's down close to. I know, dude. That's I'm on the phone. I'm like crazy, dude. I know. We're just gonna have the shit down. The trickle of latecomers is turning okay. into a flood. Bye. Hello. It, yeah, it's literally two minutes ago. I can't get any more on it. I know. I'm ever so sorry. I know. We held it for as long as we could, and they have to go now. All I can do. Yeah, because I rang up and you said that there's a 45 minute delay. No, it's actually got an early slot. It's going on on time. They're actually boarding it now. They won't accept any more now. Well, I am going to check because you know this has happened before. I mean, yeah, I mean, I've just spoken to dispatch the guys that are in charge of the aircraft. I could just put you on standby to see. We've got one at quarter past seven. And is that full? Yeah, it is full at the moment, but we've got, we're putting people on standby on it at the moment, obviously because of the traffic. We're having people coming through. No, I'm afraid not. I don't know if Devon Air have got any. 
I'm telling you the truth, it's full and I can't get anybody else. To... Well, of course I am, it's here. I wouldn't lie to you. Well, you know, I've had been lied to you before when the flight's Well, I haven't lied late. to you and I'm not lying now. I cannot accept any more passengers and all I can suggest is that we put you on standby this evening. Hi, it's me again. This is going on time, isn't it? It's nice. Yeah. It's just that I've got someone who knows someone who's going to ring up and find out. And I said, well, I can't get any more on because it's going on time. So, I mean, it's not delayed at all. All right, fine. All right, lovely. OK, then, thanks. Bye. <coughs> Jane and her team are told the flight is leaving on time, but this passenger says she's been told it's delayed by an hour. You lied to me, and she lied to me as well. I've just called your office. She told me that the slot was put forward that the 1.50 flight left on time, and in fact, it's not leaving until quarter to three. So you've lied to people. Well, I phoned, but I haven't lied to anyone, because I phoned well, actually This woman over here office. lied to everybody. And this is happening, well, this is not, just a second. This is not the first time it's happened to me. I use your airline all the time, but this will be the last time. Well, that's not you don't serious, lie to people. I didn't lie to you. you said Everyone to the here and all the other there. people who missed the plane because of the accident on the M1, you lie to them all. That plane is sitting on the tarmac outside and it has, is not leaving until a quarter to three. No more passengers can be boarded at this late stage because the doors have been secured ready for takeoff. It's not easy Jet's fault when passengers miss their flight, but Jane always takes the flack. And there's lots more to come. Oh, are you the lady who yes. told me to left? I've it's since boarded. discovered, no, I'm sorry, but I've since discovered that it's actually sitting on the tarmac. Yeah, and won't be leaving, on board. And won't be leaving until a quarter to Well, I've been told by the guy who's and in I charge really of the airport. And I really feel, I've just had a good conversation with the people over there. You're the supervisor, and it's not the first time it's happened to me. I've, I've discovered I by you. ringing up the office that you lie. You tell people planes are on the way and, the, and that they're delayed. If you just let me explain to you, the guy that's in charge of the aircraft has everybody on board and he won't accept well, so why any don't you more tell passengers because the doors are closed. So why don't you tell work. people that when I you explained to them? I told you when you got here it was too no, late and I couldn't accept no, you. No, you said the slot of your words to me. And it was going on no, time. No, your words to me were the slot has been put forward. And the, the slot plane has been put forward, yeah. You were told it was Nonsense. delayed originally. I was told it was delayed, delayed by 45 and minutes. And it hasn't. They put the slot forward. No, I'm sorry. Well, I've just been told by dispatcher it's going on time. And I just called the office. It's very easy to find out. You should check your stories. I've just been down to departures and they've told me the slot has been put forward to on Time. Uh, sorry, so I can it's only pass on the information time. that I've been given On time, it's 1.50, not quarter to three. I can only pass on the information they give to me. I'm and sorry, they tell me you lied, and I advise you not to do that. I future. haven't lied to you at all. I've just passed you on what I was told. Good morning. Oh, great. Oh, traffic jams. Southall, then. Oh, she's back again. <laughs> I get too close. Not very well today. You're not. The woman in white got away with a different airline. The flight hadn't been delayed as long as she thought. Oh God, please, please, God, please help me. God help me. God help me. God. God help me. Ah! <laughs> 
Alison's here to confront some guests she believes wrecked their apartment. The peed in the drawers, the broke two bathroom cabinets, and this was smashed off the wall and left in pieces. They've stuffed cigarettes out in the drawers. Um, the whole place was just a shambles. I can't stop them from flying, but they don't know that. I'm going to give it a go, try and, try and frighten them. Alison's determined to get a result, as she's had to spend her day off dealing with it. I do want a result out of it. I don't want nothing to happen. I do want something, even if it's self-satisfaction. The women are completely unaware of what's lying in wait for them. Mm, biddy. <laughs> Just as they're about to check in, Alison pounces. You have trashed the apartment. We've had to pay for extra cleaners. You've broken... Well, I've got photos to prove it this morning. I was called out on an emergency call. What is the damage? The chest of drawers, both of them are broken, with cigarettes stubbed out inside the drawers. Now, I don't care whether well, you've done it or not. Floor, so OK, I'm, well, I'm not interested. Those. They were urinated in. They no, were, they were. They were. They were. Alison's evidence could be on shaky ground. The urine was probably only spilt orange juice. She confronts them with the broken shelf. You just told me that you were downstairs. What is that? Oh, that fell off. That fell off. Oh, it's amazing how many people, how many things fell off the wall in that apartment? No, there? hang on, nothing fell off the wall. That was the only thing. One so of the you're girls telling me that that fell off the wall? That fell off. And, and what about the shelf in the bathroom? No shelf in the bathroom. Yes. No, I don't know any shelf. The shelf is missing. <laughs> One of the women isn't going to take it lying down. I want a copy of that bill now, though, because you are just ripping us off. That's all he's doing. If you wanted us, you had us all day today. You had mobile numbers for her and us. You when did we got here for? Excuse me. No, you didn't try us. And I'm taking legal action against you both. Yes. Good. I'm waiting for it. Come on, go for it. Yeah. One. Ole. For Jill from Ace, it's time to put her people skills to the I'll test. Tell you, you Calm gotta... down, because right. my word at the end of the day, whether you get on this flight, right, well, the way right. you are now, being aggressive and not listening to what she's trying to say. I just want to you... copy the bill. Yeah, but we'll pay her then. I will, I'll give her a visa card. She, she can't copy take the bill. visa, she's here in the airport. They're definitely going to let you two fly. I don't know about your friend. But I don't keep think she deserves... Just keep her quiet. I don't That's think she deserves to fly, Karen. 370 euros. <laughs> For nothing, a plastic thing on the wall. <laughs> the wheels of wood. Alison called the women's bluff. They were forced to pay up, and they get on the flight. I feel bad, but at the end of the day, it's only my job. What, you're going to me to the station? Huh? What you call the station right now? What's your problem? What's with your me? problem? No, what is What's your problem? What's your problem? What's your problem? You're going to call the station? Go ahead. Just. Exactly. Move. Fucking bitch. What did I do? No problem. So we found out about this raffle and decided to buy 6,000 worth of tickets to win 15. We had so many, we had to use a power saw. The place was packed with people wanting to win. <laughs> Seven, four, zero. People were upset and would boo us. Especially this guy. Individual. You're being a I'm bitch. What the right fuck are you gonna do? Down. What are you gonna do? You, I'm not gonna You're do gonna run your fucking you mouth something. and do fucking nothing. I dare you to do something. Oh, let's go outside. Let's go outside. Let it go. We're playing by the rules of the game. 
Yes. We asked before. But through all that, we continue to get picked again and again. <laughs> and again. So, until. As much as I hate to say it, the night has come to an end. It is the Queen of Hearts. We finally won. <laughs> It's dark everywhere. Um, does he work with you? Hey, why are you recording us? <laughs> hey. He got on too. What is... <laughs> and he's pink. Stop fucking following us, you little weirdo. You're gonna need to leave. Uh-uh. Hey. Stop, stop, stop. You're gonna need to leave. I'm gonna have to Point that right thing at me one more time. Stop. I'll beat your ass, boy. Stop, stop. Stop. Are you... Stop! This is the type of mess oh, we have to do when we get Oh my... Stop! Stop. Calm the fuck down. Calm the fuck down. Calm the fuck down. Look at this shit, bro. Like... We're dealing with a crazy person. Right here, crazy, crazy person, crazy, crazy person destroying the whole place. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. What's your job? Do you? Because right now you're violating my rights as, as a citizen, as a human being. You're intentionally putting me in danger. I do not wish anyone to be in danger. Thank you, then move him, ma'am. This is the full fight. I can't move him. I, I, I don't want to sit there. Do you want me to call the cops? Because I will. I'll call them right now. You can't move people because they don't want to sit next to them. He's, he's violating our rights and our safety. I asked him for his vaccine card, and he doesn't have one because he's not vaccinated. Hey, you can't move like this. You have you to have a mask and be vaccinated. You know exactly where the ball yeah. I'm not wearing a mask yeah. because yeah. I already have a mask. I have a health condition. I have children. I'm fully vaccinated to protect them. You're intentionally putting my health at risk right now. If you wish to be on this flight, I need you to take a seat. Okay, that is the seat you paid for, and it's the only one. Of the I know the law. You're breaking. You're violating the law right now. You're completely breaking the law. You have to find me another seat. It's not the law to be vaccinated to come on this flight. You can't make me breathe his oxygen because he's not vaccinated. You're not listening to me. If you wish to be on this flight, I need you to take your seat. I'm not sitting there. You're putting my life in danger right now. I cannot be made to breathe his oxygen. That's not fair. That's the seat you paid for. Do you want me to see my children? Oh, yes. You're putting them at risk. I have one available. I don't want to sit there. He's not vaccinated. You're intentionally putting my life in danger. Now you're not putting your life in danger. I'm not going to sit there. No, I'm not sitting there. How many times do I have to say this? I know how, uh, how challenging air travel is. But there will be no discrimination on my aircraft. It's not discrimination. Vaccinated or unvaccinated, we should respect each other. <laughs> yes. And as it seems, you have trouble doing that? Please, Me. exit the airport. <laughs> for the delay. We'll do our best to get you into London, England on schedule. Hopefully making up some of that lost time. Uh, so sit back, relax, and enjoy your food. It's public property. You're absolutely out of it's here. Pub You're going to get arrested, I'm telling you. OMG. You no, are OMG. just as bad as the officer yeah. over in Lowell, no, girl. No, you are just as bad as everybody I listen to that won't listen. I don't live in China. Is there anybody here it that does not, not wear a mask? It is not a communist country. Is everybody here I would like to you know right now. Okay. That's all I'm asking. Okay, that's all I'm asking. Wow. Not don't tell you. me what to do. I'm going to tell you what to do. Get off of me. What are you going to do? Yeah. Do you want to get arrested? You're going to get arrested. I have finally I have a public arrest I'm going to give you one effort, to, uh, one opportunity to walk away. One. One opportunity. One opportunity. Turn around with your hands up. No. 
Seriously. Yes. Yeah. Seriously. Yeah. Seriously. Can I have that? Right now. For what? Right. For what? Just all the other oh. combat. Get off of me. Get off of me. Get off of me. I did nothing wrong. 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 I did I did nothing wrong. I did nothing wrong. Dad, I should I should have freedom of speech. Freedom of speech. You do not have freedom of speech in America. And you are going Yeah, I'm gonna go on. <laughs> I did nothing wrong. I don't believe I don't believe in China. I don't care. I want to the United States of America. Stop it, Stop. Don't yeah. Yeah. Stop. Yeah. Yeah. No, Pat, you do it. Pat, you do it. Pat, you do it. Pat. Pat. You do it. Pat. You do it. Pat. Pat. Get off. <laughs> you get off. I I can call Jesus. Oh, that's that spirit in you. Come on out. Get away from me. Get away from me. Get away from me. Get away. Get away. I don't. My father's already here. He's omnipresent. He's present. He's a present help in the time of trouble. You're distressed. I can call on Jesus. He answers prayer. He he answers prayer. You go, you leave me alone. You're you're getting closer to me. You're you're by my car, sweetie. You're you're by my car. You go. On. You go and be great with your lavender. Go. Go back to where you came from. And I believe. <laughs> go on, sweetie. Get away. Get with your jerry beads. Go. Do that, you fucking chink. I love you too. You fucking bitch. Get out of here, man. Okay? You started it. You started it. Guys, no. She started it. She goes, I don't know what a signal is. You don't know what a signal is? Guess what? Even in China, they have signal lights. Yeah, you kick me, you kick me, I'll take those fucking glasses off your face and shove them through your... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what you do when you have a signal. You, you see a signal? You see a signal? It's called, you use it. Oh. Are you going to take me? Take me, I don't care. Take me all you want. Get my phone. I'm going to call 911. Then I'm going to tell them that she kicked me. There we go. You kicked me. I'm calling 911 and I'm going to have you charged. You're kicking me. You just kicked me right here. You just kicked me right here, bitch. What was that, that funny? Get your hands off. Give us the board back. private property. Go ahead. My name's Carol. I'm the manager. Nice to meet you. There, now you got some funny. Please, just give us the board. We'll leave. It's here 24 hours a day. If you do that, okay, now I am calling. Excuse me. I'll leave if you give me my board. Just give us the board. Uh, get out of my way! Just give us the right board. Now! Please, just give us the board and we'll leave. <laughs> oh no! Dude, get the fuck. So Damn, this is fun. Sorry, folks, we're gonna have to deboard you. So I Are you serious? Oh my god! Oh, wow. Woman, get off the plane! We don't have time okay. to get off the plane! Oh, 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 please listen to the plane. No, board. we've been please, already on the plane for like an hour. We'll take care of it. You got to be kidding me right now. Oh, Are you? Oh, 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 you? Then get out of here. I already told you once. Get the fuck out. Get in your car. Drive the fuck away. And don't ever come back here again. Not once. Have you ever been to this beach before? 
Have I ever been to this beach before? Have you ever been to churches or lowers or middles? But you don't even know how to go left. But you don't even know that you can never do it. That you can never. Are you a surfer? Am I a surfer? I'm a sailor, bitch. But you couldn't sail, huh? You can't sail. You don't even know how the wind works. You're going to sail around here?